I'm finally to where I want to be, like heading the professional ranks. Uh, I did my time in college and I'm ready to hit it off here. Do you think that it's going to take a world record to make it to the final? No. no. <laughs> uh, this race is all about just being top three. Um, everybody knows that, so some people will have to PB to do it. Some people will just have to finish and someone's going to PB, so we got to be at our best. Now everyone is talking about how you pretty much already raced like a vet. And how do you, like, what do you owe that to, pretty much? I love that to coach. He's put me in a position to where I can do that. Um, race limited this year compared to other collegiates and um, put me in some races with the big guys. Now a part of the big guys, but um, yeah, so it just makes sure I like have to finish the race instead of just getting the start and just blowing everybody out because if I don't finish, they're going to get me. Yeah. Congrats, Trey. Thank you. Trey, what have the last couple of weeks been like for you? It's just been a little stressful with uh, shoe deal, school. I had a lot of school to do. I actually took a midterm Tuesday or Wednesday and had to work on my thesis a little bit too, but practice has been kind of chill. Um, we know what we have to do here, so we've just been fine tuning a few things and making sure we're healthy at the line. How close are you to graduation? So I graduated undergrad. Um, I have two classes left this summer and whenever I finish my thesis for my master's. What's your master's in? Sport management. So you're gonna stay in Tallahassee then? Yeah, I'm gonna stay in Tallahassee. Uh, it's working. What me and coach have going on, it's working, so I don't wanna mess it up. Feel any different going to the blocks as a professional? Not really, it's still the same thing, still the same blocks, still 10 hurdles, still the same guys I've been racing against all year, so nothing different. Grant's also Adidas. Mm -hmm. Is there like some sort of secret Adidas back channel now that you have access to? No. I mean, the only back channel is we're going to whoop the Nike guys in every hurdle race for the next 10 years. So, Did he, did he talk to you about the deal? Like, no. Did you talk to him at all? No. Me and Grant have different agents, so I don't really intermingle with that. But who's, who's your agent? Mark Wetmore. Was the process as you thought it would be, or were there surprises along the way? Um, I, it went a little slower than I thought, just because like there was a few things going on like no one knew like who was leaving early who wasn't leaving like I'm sure Abby has some big decisions on her plate too um, and Fambule like they all have big choices to make too so like there's some big big hitters that have been coming out of college so I think that slowed down the process just a little bit because everyone's asking for a lot of money <laughs> seems to be shaping up to be like a historic mm -hmm. race tomorrow do you feel any of that I mean I tell people I've grown up in the greatest hurdle generation ever more than likely like when it's all done it probably will be um so every time all five of those top guys line up it's going to be a great race when when grant was back still in college and running the collegiate record did you think that you'd be back to a spot where you'd have a shot to beat him oh 100 i mean i've been chasing after that man because he's a year older than me my entire life um now i think we're about equal this year so we'll see what happens thank you